This week's workout is the bottom shaper. So for this one, we're gonna get down on the floor. Now, as I've said before, if you're on a hard surface, you'll need a mat, but carpeted surfaces, you don't necessarily need a mat. So we're gonna get down on the floor. Okay, I'm gonna get into all fours. And I just wanna point out at this stage that we need to keep our tummies pulled in and our backs nice and straight. Okay, we're gonna start off with the knees directly under our hips and our hands directly under our shoulders, but slightly wider than our shoulders, just for good support. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take out one leg behind and we're going to lift the leg, so we lift it beyond the line of the knee and then come back down and lift and down. Okay, so we're lifting up. Okay, and as you can see, it's just my leg that's moving, the rest of my body is nice and still, so I'm not doing any of this business where I'm arching the back, I'm keeping the rest of my body still and I'm lifting and lowering. Okay, so we're gonna lift and lift, lower and lower, and we're gonna do eight sets of those. Okay, and then when we've done eight sets, we're gonna bend the knee and we're gonna do eight pulses at the end. Okay, and then we're gonna have a rest, and then we're gonna go again on the other side. So eight lifts, up and down, and then bend the knee, eight pulses, pushing that heel up to the ceiling. Lovely, and then have a rest. About a minute's rest after you've done the two, and then go again for another set. And of course, as before, if you're feeling ultra fit, you can try for three sets.